What's up, YouTube? Hi, guys. Welcome back to my channel. King DC is really dark. It is um, almost 10 p.m. here in Florida. Today, I want to talk about... Uh, I've been doing this for a while. I've had a monologue, and I was kind of... I threw it away because it was really nasty and rude to the producers and the writers who did Supergirl's finale. Uh, don't mind my dog. He's in the <laughs> chat. Um, so... If you not know, Supergirl's ended, and a lot of people on podcasts are talking about how how they they wrote Supercorp, Carlina, down Car Downs and Lena Luther, Lexi's sister. Um, but I, I'm part of the fandom. I want, really wanted them to be in game because for five freaking years they built up their friendship and their relationship. From all the way from season two, three, four, five, and six, and I was really hoping that to be canon, because these writers, I'm gonna show you who I just finished watching later. And it's two seconds, and this, the writers keep queer baiting, and the writer came out. I don't remember his name is Jay or J. Jay. I'll show you and I'll zoom in his face in a minute. He's basically. Defending his homeboys, his boys and girls of the writer's room because they're the ones who are queer baiting. And apparently, if he wanted to make Carly a canon, he had to go CW, he had to go ask CW first, call the network, them first, then call the DC Comics, Warren Brothers, producers, second producer, co producer, and the big middleman on top, which we don't know his face is. And that's how we get Supercorp Cannon. Now I'm going to show you who I was watching. Um, my camera, I'm going to show you. This guy right here. Talking about queer baiting, Supercorp and queer baiting. And it was, not, it was really messed up. Now, <clears throat> cameraman. And so it really pissed me off when he was like, kind of like, Glossing over the fact that he knows people who are quibbling us and not stopping it. So, um, if you know Adam from YouTube, he's a big, he's a big, uh, he's a big Cara and Lena shipper. And he's upset because this was the biggest, his words, the biggest quibbling in history, television history. We did not get, we did not get Carly and Cannon. I'll also be watching other podcasts saying that they, CW, missed out on bank. They missed out, they missed out that they can, if they put Carly and Ken, their, their freaking rings would shoot their freaking roof. And we would have Carly, we would have Supercorp. Carly and I, Carly Danvers and Leah Luther. Um, season 6 just ended and I'm still kind of pissed off. That we, I didn't get the ending I wanted. So basically, Supercorp is basically my favorite, my other, my other queer ship, well, all the non queer ship, non canon queer ship, um, Xena and Gabrielle from Xena the Warrior Princess. They kissed a couple of times, but it was more like, like, like a fairy tale kind of like Disney Channel stuff. Like, there's one episode when Gabrielle is basically like Sleeping Beauty. And Cena was like her Prince Charming to wake her up and she woke up from her terrible nightmare. Um, and then there's also parallels between um, Lois and Clark Kent, Superman and his wife. And then there's, I'll just make a freaking part two for that later. It's in the night, I'm getting really tired. But this is, this, this is not, this is not fair. So thank you for watching. Leave a comment down below. Um, subscribe to my channel. Check out my spring break video. And I'll see you guys later. Bye guys.